Hey guys, and welcome to the fight of the week. In this video, we're going to look at a team fight that happened between Fnatic and Dynasty in the finals of the European Vainglory 8. Let's watch it in real time, and then we'll break it down. Oh, oh my god, it's not the gauntlet, it's the god net to let the fearsome shade. He's got one, he's got two, he plays like he's Starboy, but we know it's Europe. That's not Starboy, it's just your net. Look at this, the burning, the Palmatoro dropping the Spitfire to Coombs. Lonely, nowhere to go, nowhere to hide. Rika Meza, you have to play like a god, the legend. Your team needs you, and he'll be chopped down. Tetno, hey, hey, come through with the ace. So, Fnatic win this fight, but it was started by Dynasty. Mowgli uses War Treads, and he's gonna move up to look for a gauntlet onto Fnatic. His team moves towards the left, but he goes to the right. Mowgli goes for the gauntlet, but he's stunned by Ordain, cancelling off his ultimate. The gauntlet would have caught three, which is a major bummer. And Rika Mesa is super far behind his team at this point, making it hard to follow up with damage. Net Toilette throws out Fearsome Shade, catching Mowgli, and then he uses Echo to refresh his ultimate ability. PT Lamb, in the meanwhile, tries to focus down Tetno JJ, but he's losing the trade, and he's now vulnerable standing in Goop. PT Lamb would avoid the second Fearsome Shade by using Shimmer Strike into Mowgli, but Mowgli and Rikumeza were caught by the Fearsome Shade. During this whole time, Palmatora was burning them down with the Dragon's Breath. PT Lamb would jump out of the Shimmer Strike towards Scarf, but then he has to immediately reposition defensively using Shroud Step after Net Atlases him. Mowgli uses Fountain, and now it was Atlas Pauldron, hitting Tetno and Net. It feels like it was a little late on the Atlas. The fight's been going 9 seconds, and Rikumeza has zero broken myth stacks. As the fight goes on, Net Toilette takes some burst damage. He drops low, using the fountain to keep himself alive. PT Lamb is standing in some burning goop and will fall shortly. And the whole time, Riku Mesa is still on the edge of the fight and missing most of his forward barrage. It feels like maybe Riku Mesa should have a chance here, kiting backwards. But the war treads from Tetno JJ and Overdriven Faint of Heart guaranteed nobody would be slowed as they charged Riku Mesa down. Fnatic would go on to win this game and take first place in week one of Split 2. So now that we've broken it down, let's go ahead and watch it back in real time. He's got one, he's got two, he plays like he's Starboy, but we know it's Europe, that's not Starboy, it's just your net. Look at this, the burning, the Palmatoro dropping the Spitfire to Coombs, Mowgli, nowhere to go, nowhere to hide, Riku Meza, you have to play like a god, the legend, your team needs you, and he'll be chopped down, Tetno, hey, hey, coming through with the ace, Ian. This has been your fight of the week, thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon.